Thinly, do you want them sliced? And do you want them sliced like this? Super thin? No. Super thin? A bit fatter than that. <laughs> yeah, something like that. You said thinly sliced. Yeah, that'll be fine. I, d I don't like it too s well. No, is that too big? That's as big as I usually do it. I usually do it even bigger. So, but because I just I was just thinking about it because we've got other vegetables. That's probably about right. Something like that. Okay. That's one pepper. Is that the only pepper? That's the only pepper. Seriously, Papa? We've got munch to spinach, um, broccoli. I've got more broccoli. I can make it with more broccoli. That's not going to be here, but you'll have to have leftovers, I think, from one of the days. Wait, is he at London? <coughs> I was wondering why he asked about the I How big would you like the broccoli? The what? How big? Small would... for it. <laughs> okay. Is this small or is this small? That's fine. Yeah, split the other one in half. They're all about small then. So it wasn't much. Okay. Broccoli is cut. I don't think we need too much more, but make because you're yeah, maybe about as much of that again. Same amount again. Right, that's the rice cooking. Let me get rid of that. Is that too much? 
Is this too much? Yeah, oh, that's probably too much. Sure, because I didn't mind checking extra in mine. Well, you can if you want, because I don't know when, what else I'm going to use it for at the moment. Out with broccoli! 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 I'm on my last brain cell. Yeah, not <laughs> I got so concerned. It's such a silly anxiety, but I got so concerned um, when on Saturday night because you went to bed and then Dad didn't go to bed and he stayed on the sofa. But I didn't know he was ill. Um, so in my head, I was like, I was like, most most of the night until I went to sleep, I was like, has something happened? Are they are they now going to be sleeping in separate rooms? Is like, why didn't he just go to the spare bedroom if they're going to be sleeping in separate rooms? I am beginning to wonder whether you should sleep in separate rooms. No, because um, yeah, Dad wants to turn the light on in the middle of the night, and I can't bear that. Write him a strongly worded letter. Get him a torch. He probably just wants an yeah, upgrade. I mean, he's he trying to get a torch. Even the torch I'm not very keen on. Um, and then I'm restless. I wake up and I'm restless. Partly hormones and partly stress. And so, um, so he, then I disturb him. So... Yeah, but in terms of a, not like... But it's not because we've had a row. I mean, Dad actually slept on the sofa in Pajara <laughs> nearly every single night. Why? He'd bed for about two hours and then he'd get up and he'd sleep on the sofa. Why? Well, he'd say he doesn't sleep well because of the antivirals, but I don't think it's that. He just doesn't sleep well. And then he, he's just got into the habit of reading in the middle of the night. So because I, if he wake, he wakes me up if he turns the light on. So he's going out there and then getting tired and sleeps on the sofa. Seen Uncle Sam do it too many times. Well, to be fair, his dad, their dad used to do it. You know, and they they all say I'm not asleep. <laughs> Uh, do you want this in slices? Like yeah. thin slices, thick slices? Uh, thin slices, and then let me try a tiny bit in case it's very nice. I don't know, Ben can't eat it too spicy, we can eat it, but um, I don't know what I ate it in completely. Okay. We always add extra, to, uh, you know, on top. Mm -hmm.
we have matching scars and I forget and then I look and I'm like oh yeah what's that <laughs> we've got matching scars on our arm oh. <laughs> oh, yeah. and the other side the other. <laughs> I should edit this and then ask you to do the voiceover. Before doing writing, can't you? True. I think it's more engaging to have a voiceover. I mean, these days, well, I've noticed that people do captions Possibly. of what they're saying. Yeah. Like already on the screen. I'm going to try and do that for my next video and see how it. Yeah, right, I definitely don't need any more to pay up for better than that. Right, I need to chop the chicken. Um, if you can... Oh, I was going to grate the lime, wasn't I? Yeah. I was waiting for you to so tell me to. I've had enough of that. Did you taste the chilli? The paste? Or the, oh, the actual chilli? No, I haven't. Dishwasher, probably. I mean, it's from Sainsbury's, so it's not state of the art. Or Tesco, actually. Might be from Tesco. I'm going to use your phone next time. This could be a little thing. Mother daughter diaries cooking. <laughs> I'm sure there must be others on, online, but yeah. What other people doing here? Yeah? There must be. Well, I'm not saying it's a unique idea. Yeah. <laughs> no, I didn't say you were a unique idea. in politics or something I don't know it would compare life or you know like etiquette about children's parties or you know they compare it in the states to here and that sort of thing or having dinner parties or I don't know I quite like the comparison between the English expected in English etiquette and the American yeah. oh, that's quite interesting they don't do it anymore it was just a thing they did for a while Chicken to it, like have a third pot. Okay. 
We're going to need more, aren't we? More what? Then if I put more coconut milk in it, or, um... I've got double cream. Or soy milk. Or... Let's just let it... By the time the liquid come out of the vegetables, it probably... Where is it? 
sound good. It's not so. Would it help if I held um, the bag and poured it in to the jug? I just find this is the way that makes it go all over everywhere. Can I attempt to pour it? No, because it just goes everywhere. Because there's nothing in this. It catches in oh, here. Okay. There's no no way of pouring it in. The only way of pouring it in is when it's nearly empty. I cut the top off. You know, when there's not that much in there, I cut the top off and then I pour it. But, um, otherwise, it just ends up with grains of rice everywhere. Mm. Having tried lots of different ways of doing it, sweat the rice. Show the best in the air. Yeah. Show the girl in the bed and show the girl. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Mercy, but poor old chicken. Chicken, chicken. Yeah. Oh, I can just follow you to be fair because I've made a bit of a mess. Follow me? What do you mean? Like downstairs or something. I'm, I'm really, I'm really not making any sense. Right, I can <laughs> sort of gather what you're doing. Waste of time. Yeah, Yes. Okay, I'm just sprinkling coriander. And then I've got coriander on my finger. It's Milan. Okay. It will taste bonita. Bonita. What? Put mine on there. I want to spot the difference. <laughs> There's more to two in there, spinach and broccoli, Ben, so there shouldn't be anything too alien. Oh. Yeah, just leave it. Oh. Yeah. I know what. Spinach, broccoli. Chicken. Um, I don't see any chicken. <laughs> uh, and the chicken is over here, look. Chicken. Just leave, Dad, yes, chicken. Just leave some for Dad to have um, some tomorrow. Okay. Not so. cooking tomorrow? Well, he can have it as a leftover. I wasn't going to cook tomorrow. <laughs>